Time now to hear from our legal expert, Greg Isaacs. Greg, as always, thank you for being here. Lori, it's good to be here. This is a week, a special one, especially here in Knox County. It is spring break, and some people have not had the chance to travel like this in quite a while. So time for your yearly reminder. Greg, spring break is not a vacation from the law. It is not, Lori. When you pack the sunscreen, don't forget your common sense when you're taking your spring break trip. So let's talk about what the do's and don'ts are of spring break. Mainly uh, we hear about drinking. We hear about drinking, and Florida is already uh, all over the World Wide Web warning people, don't vacation here if you're going to drink and drive, etc. So consequences can be very severe. Remember, uh, Tennessee is part of the interstate compact on driver's licenses. Mm -hmm. So even if you get a, a speeding ticket, uh, no driver's license, whatever, you've got to go back to where you were pulled over uh, or you can have points uh, on your license. But uh, underage drinking against the law here in Tennessee, uh, against the law in Florida. Drinking age in Florida is 21. Uh, Tennessee, if you're under 21, it's a underage DWI. So instead of the national threshold under the Federal Highway Traffic Safety Administration standard of 0 .08, it's .02 if you're a young spring breaker. You know, and this kind of stuff really can follow you, it, like you it, said. It's it, just not worth it. it can. And for example, let's say you uh, have an open container. Uh, now, Florida, many counties, and it differs from county to county mm -hmm. to county on alcohol use and curfews. So you need to know based on the venue that you're traveling to. Uh, but for example, Miami Beach. No alcohol on the beach, no coolers, uh, no open alcohol in vehicles, etc. A lot of people still don't know that. They don't, and if you got they a, learn a, when they go. A ticket for underage consumption or possession. Mm -hmm. uh, you think it's not a big deal, you don't yeah. want mom and dad to know. Uh, it could impact your license. Uh, under Tennessee law, it could be revoked for a year under the Youthful Offenders Act. So don't ignore it. Treat it serious. Mm -hmm. DUI, absolutely serious. Florida each year sees approximately 400. Uh, crashes, 400,000 crashes, wow. uh, 3,100 fatalities, and almost a third of those are alcohol related, and they they spike in March. So absolutely heartbreaking and such heartbreaking. a loss for so many families. Right, and the cost, you have to retain a lawyer. Yeah. You have to go to court, a mandatory jail time in Florida. Mm -hmm. So just remember, uh, know that there are going to be curfews. Know that you've got to be responsible. Mm -hmm. And it goes beyond being responsible because there are a lot of places that you can't drink outside mm -hmm. of restaurants. But basically, Lori, uh, don't forget your common sense and have a great spring break. Yeah, thank you, Greg. Thank you. And if you have a legal question for Greg, just email askisaacs at wate.com. And remember, Greg comes in for Ask Isaacs every Wednesday at 530 right here on WATE 6 on your side.